Serena hath made a high Awakens. 
beast emerges from the darkest corners of my heart. My burdens prevent further cumbrance. Be my wares. Go with God, young one. Path of Cain is the only escape. Follow it. Let it lead you.
Then came the deluge. A great flood. A great war was waged, the elders against their children, and the children... One who prizes the living over the dead. Thou hast entered the halls of King Vaklav the First. Thy canine flesh must be unraveled from thy canine bones, that thou may enter the halls of the dead, naked of all what thy canine spirit. <laughs> Ah! 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 Ah!
own Kristoff. There are worse fates than death. And worse than unlife is a vampire. Thou spoke true. Not disobey me, child. to ye, young sir. Have my hand on it. It is a deal. Behold the reliquary with the arm of St. George. I pray thee, tell us of those that are missing. Yes, thou hast done well. We shall tell thee a tale to curdle thy blood. Thy absent friends and vanished allies now dwell in Vienna, at the chantry of the damnable clan Tremere. They abduct mortals and turn them into ghouls that they may have foot soldiers in their bloody war against the Zemitsi. 
But now the Tremere have undertaken to abduct their fellow vampires in violation of all Cainite law. They conjoin the flesh of many vampires to create demonic gargoyles to fight the Zemitsi. Such are the ways of those that did once plunder the power of Cain by committing an unspeakable act upon a grandchild of Cain. Where have they taken the slaves? We know not, but our spies have ferreted out their slave master. His name is Arden, and he dwelleth in a secret Tremere Chantry hidden within an alchemist shop in Golden Lane. We seek thy princely permission to attack him and liberate such slaves as he has taken. Such dispensation I do not give lightly, for we of Clan Ventru have lately joined in an alliance with the Tremere. We do use the Tremere for our own ends against the hated Zemitsi clan. Yet for their crimes against my city, the Tremere must pay a debt of blood. We do bestow our princely dispensation upon thee. Thou mayst assault Arden's chantry and liberate such Cainite slaves as he has taken. May we liberate mortal slaves as well, or does the prince care not for those whose blood sustains us? I see that Ekaterina the Wise has not yet tamed the impertinent tongue of this child. I shall assist her in the chore. <coughs> now that thou hast paid the price, I give thee full dispensation to liberate such mortals as thou findeth within Arden's chantry. Now get thee from my sight. <laughs>